Hey everybody, welcome to TXGameHunters.com. I'm Joseph Truzel. I'm here with a special guest. How's it going, sir? Good. Would you like to introduce yourself to everybody? Uh, my name is Steve Lemonov. I'm the director of marketing at the ATN, and I'm glad Joseph is here at SHOT, who was able to make it, and uh, wanted to talk to you guys about the new products we're launching this year at SHOT. I know one product everybody's been asking about, well, more than one product, but one that we're gonna talk about that I know I'm really excited with is the new Bluetooth remote, which is right here. So tell me a little bit about the remote and what it can do and, you sure. know. Absolutely. So the remote uh, talks to the our smart HD line of scopes, um, both uh, Excite and the Thor HD via Bluetooth. It has a Bluetooth module. Uh, we have a tactile function, so there's like feedback. And uh, we have a roller for smooth zoom. Uh, we have a home button, so basically, if out of any menu, you can click the home button, and it'll get you to the home oh, screen so you don't right have to away. Keep pressing back. <laughs> yes, yeah, <I> know <laughs> that's, that's awesome. Open. I like, like that. In the home screen, that button also acts as a max zoom and min zoom. So you press it once, it goes to uh, the scope goes to max zoom automatically. I press it again, it goes to min zoom. That's a great feature. Yeah. Um, the actual the remote can be reversed. You could program in the scope which orientation you want the roller to be. So if this way is not comfortable, you could switch it around and have it the other way okay. for yourself. Because for some people it might get in the way having the zoom uh, right there, the, the way it's positioned right now. Uh, the buttons uh, correspond exactly um, the way the X side is oriented. So anything you, you can do by hand on the X side uh, or Thor HD, you can do the same thing with the remote. Basically activate video, activate still image, um, go to the menu. Uh, Go uh, scroll through the menu, activate any features and functions you want to do on the scope through the remote control. So, especially when you're when you're zeroing it in, uh, or when you're holding it yeah. in your hand, and you know you're trying to navigate the the rifle in one hand and going to the scope, it's not really comfortable at times. That's a great add-on. It's only seventy nine dollars retail. Um, it's going to start shipping end of March, beginning of April. End of March, beginning of April. I know I'm excited to when they come out to, for to buy one, and I know a lot of you guys are. This is definitely going to make life easier because I, I have heard one of you know one of the complaints people has is you know when they're holding their rifle, right. they have to get up here and, and with right. their other hand. And the only thing you can't control is the focus for distance. Um, unfortunately, it's not a. a um, electronic focus it's a manual focus so we weren't able to have that control in the remote control as well mm -hmm. um, but really the focus I haven't I haven't noticed there's not a whole bunch of fine-tuning once yeah. you're set you're pretty much, much set, there, right give or take a little bit right, right, you right. know depending on if well if you're going from like 20 yards to 200 yards then there's gonna be Maybe, a little yeah, bit right but if you're from like 100 to 200 yards there's not a whole bunch of tuning right. that you have to do right uh, but I'm that's I'm really excited about that. It's a great addition, and uh, kudos to you guys for, for coming up and, and developing that. Now, the next thing that I am really excited about, and I know the idea is, how did you guys come up with the idea for this? Because I know people have been talking about, like, I wish that, you know, we had something like this. So how did you guys come up with the idea for the laser? Uh, predominantly user feedback. You know, people always want to know how far, um, how far the you know the target is uh, that they're shooting uh, shooting and they want to know you know how to adjust their dope overhead you know hold over so we came up with this solution because we knew we had uh, a Bluetooth function in the smart HD line of scope so you know might as well utilize it uh, besides just the you know remote function yeah. so the way the system works is it has uh, the ranging mode and you pair the device to your smart HD scope, either uh, XI2 or Thor HD. And once you have your ballistic profile set up in one of the smart HD scopes, you can uh, range your target. The laser rangefinder will send the range uh, instantaneously to the scope, and the scope will adjust the point of impact, uh, adjust the reticle. To that range that you Through just the calculated. right as long as you have it activated <laughs> absolutely and it's um, correct you know the salient characteristics that you input in the ballistic cal calculator are you know what they should be basically. yeah because if you don't give it the correct information it's, it's not, not going to make the right choices absolutely so basically you can go to ranging a target and making the shot in under five ten seconds right That's, absolutely and 
the, the rangefinder feature that comes with the scope that differs because that's more of a calculation based. It's a, it's a more geometrical finder. mathematical calculation. You have to know uh, the height of the target, which sometimes is not really possible or, or easy to ascertain. Mm -hmm. uh, we have some presets, but those are generalities. You know, yeah. the internal rangefinder works best if you're fairly accurate with the height of the target. Yeah. And then if you measure correctly, also um, you know do the one, two, three step uh, internally. Otherwise, it's fairly accurate. This is, of course, a lot more accurate. It's up to one yard variation. So if you're ranging it with certainty, you're within one yard of and the one yard number. is not going to make a difference no, on, on, ballistics, on, a, no. on the ballistics. I know with the built-in rangefinder, we got it. We, we saw it was very accurate when we actually measured the height and did it that way. Right. The only issue that we found was, you know, when you're moving species. Like if you're deer hunting, you have a preset for deer. Right. And then a little hog comes up. Yeah. It's not going to be accurate. No. But this, it doesn't matter what comes up because it's a laser range finder and it feeds right. it automatically. The only kind of caveat is it is only daytime. You know, uh, it's in order to make it a night vision, it would be a lot bigger. It would cost a lot more because this thing is going to retail at uh, 279 for the 1,000 yard model and 349 for the 1,500 yard model. Which is so. pretty much the same price as a 1,000 and 1,500 a regular, yard, regular one anyways. Or, yeah. And if you don't have an ATN smart HD product, which you should, but if you don't, you there's an app. I mean, there's an app that you guys yeah, have that you can Yeah, we came up with another solution. So basically, if you have a traditional day scope, um, it doesn't matter really which day scope you have. Uh -huh. We've developed a ballistic calculator app that you could download on your uh, Android or Apple phone. And again, also you have to input, you know, the characteristic, the ballistic information, all this other environmental information. Once you have a profile built, uh, you could range the target and a graphical, uh, the program will tell you exactly how many clicks on your turrets and your day scope you need to make to hit your target basically. Oh, that's cool. So, range it 500 yards. Right. I put all my ballistics in there, set to 100 yards. Right. And it says you need to do five clicks this way, five right. clips for the windage. Right. And, and boom, you're on. Absolutely. So, I mean, with that, I mean, the only time it's going to take you is the time it's going to take you to actually turn and make the Pretty clips. much, right. That's really cool. So, anybody can benefit from this. Everybody can benefit. You don't have to use... Uh, <laughs> you don't have to use ballistic uh, charts or calculators. You know, the more accurate information you feed in the app, the the more accurate it'll you know give you uh, give you the information back. But yeah, it'll definitely speed up uh, the long range precision shooting for sure. And just a side note on that, the biggest mistake that I've seen is the sight height, mm. because there's a big confusion. You know, some people say, is it center to center? Yes, it's center of the board or the center of the scope. Correct? That's yes. how you guys designed it. Right and you want to be precise so if it's two two point seven five inches you don't want to round it up to three you want no. to put in exactly what right. it is right uh because calculations are very precise right well i'm super excited and when are these going to start to ship i believe this should start shipping toward the end of january so, so if i'm if i'm correct right around the corner absolutely <laughs> Well, consider my pre-order put in. All right. <laughs> well, thank you very much for your time. Uh, we're very excited. Uh, I mean, all the videos we've done, this is just going to make them even better. So Absolutely. Thank you for your time, yeah. sir. I thank appreciate you. it. Appreciate you coming by. Go, you can go to the website, atmcourt.com. You can go to your local ATM dealer. They're all going to have information on this when they become available to dealers. Uh, you guys are going to have pre-sales pre open again pretty soon on these. Right. So, yeah, visit atmcourt.com right here on the bottom of the screen and check it out for yourself.